East Timor. The context of it, recently President Hota of Timor Leste awarded President Drabdi Murmu the Grand Collar of the Order of Timor Leste, recognizing her contribution to public service, education, and women's empowerment about East Timor. Under this heading, Portugal colonized the area in the 18th century and is remained under their hands until 1975. After the Portuguese left, Indonesian troops invaded and conquered East Timor as their 27th province. This East Timor, this East Timor lies in the Indonesia, south of Indonesia and between Australia. Here it is Australia, here it is Indonesia. And there, are, there is a nearby Timor Sea is existing. Timor Sea exists. After a long and brutal war for independence in which at least one lakh people died, the East Timor voted for independence in United Nations supervised referendum in 1999. But the violence escalated until peacekeeping force were permitted to enter. In 2002, the United Nations formally recognized the country. East Timor has submitted an application to join the Association of South East Asian Nations, that is ASEAN. It is now classified as an observer. The Bayou Undan gas field East Timor's major revenue source is scheduled to dry up by 2023 and the country is now looking to cooperate with co corporations like Australia Santos to convert it into carbon capture facilities. Its geography under this heading East Timor is made up of the eastern half of Timor Island with the western half belonging to Indonesia. It has a land area of 15,000 square kilometers, slightly smaller than Israel, with a population of 1.3 million people who are mostly Roman Catholic. Which country colonized East Timor in 18th century? Option A, Spain. Option B, Portugal. Option C, Netherlands. Option D, France. So please give your answer in the comment box.